Hi everybody, welcome back again. So, in the last video with multimeters, um, I showed you the sunshine test with my Agilent U1272A and 1273A. Um, the response was quite encouraging and one of the questions was asked was, well, what is it really like indoors? Obviously the LCD display won hands down for the outside in sunshine uh, tests, but what is this going to be like inside in a basically LED lit room and we'll have a look now. So let's just turn these puppies on and see what they do. So LCD, this one, the OLED. As you can see, the OLED one is standing out quite considerably. It's as good indoors or it's as much better indoors to the LCD display as the LCD was as an improvement of the OLED one outside. So it's pretty comprehensive there. I mean they're both with the you know looking with a human eye and looking with the reflections from the uh, overhead lighting they're both very readable but the OLED display definitely stands out considerably above the Agilent as you can see there, all right, let me just bring in this one if I just turn it just a little bit maybe because it's some reflections but you can see it quite well um, but it's not as visible as this one all right, it, I mean I can turn that quite a way either around and it's still quite visible right? whereas the LCD display it's readable straight on but indoors not as good as the OLED so if you want visibility the OLED definitely for inside the LCD definitely for outside if you want battery life though then the LCD one wins hands down because it's going to last in excess of 200 hours um, whereas the OLED one is sort of 60 plus hours now one of you commented also about uh, the flickering and I can actually see it looking on the um, screen of the camera right now I see it scrolling down and what that is is that the OLED display is actually scanning and refreshing and the camera is actually picking that up when I look directly at it I cannot detect it with the human eye it's just the shutter speed of the camera so anyway um, there you have it there's the indoor comparison you asked for it you've got it hope you're happy um, I know I am um, I guess I'm lucky because I've got the best of both I've got the LCD for outside and I've got the OLED for inside and to be honest the LCD does work well enough inside as well I mean that's a traditional um, display that's been used for a long long time um, and uh, is tried and tested gives you good battery life and everything else so it's nothing to be sniffed at but if you're working in a dim area obviously the dimmer the light levels the harder it's going to be to see an LCD and that's where you would have to start turning on the backlight and of course if you turn the backlight on that's when your battery capacity is going to go down the OLED one on the other hand um, you already know it's going to be consuming a certain amount of battery as expected so there would be no surprises and you can actually read it from quite a distance away so there you have it now you can make your own choice. Thanks.